Hello, welcome to Massage 2 ABB, a wonderful world full of beautiful fauna and flora along with massive amounts of natural resources ripe for exploitation. I've been sent here by Fixit, a totally not evil intergalactic space corporation to exploit those yummy natural resources but I've run into a bit of a problem. You see, factory building is hard work and I quickly became bored of the weird pistachios hopefully not poisonous berries and magic mushrooms that the environment had to offer. But while I was looking through the list of parts I'd eventually be creating, something caught my eye. Nuclear pasta. Upon reading this I became filled with a new focus, a whole new sense of purpose. I never knew that Satisfactory had an industrial food manufacture component, but I wasn't complaining. I knew I had to start making it, but the problem is I was only up to about here in terms of progression, and I would need to get to here to be able to produce a mean bowl of mac and cheese. Knowing what had to be done, I set out modifying my existing factory to produce the parts needed. While he's doing that, I'm going to take this opportunity to explain what nuclear pasta actually is. Put simply, nuclear pasta is incredibly dense matter theorised to exist within the crusts of neutron stars. If it does exist, it would be the strongest material in the universe, so not exactly something you would want to use to make mac and cheese. But the problem is, he doesn't know that. He's thinking of this. He's going to be very disappointed when the first unit is finished and he gets incredibly dense degenerate matter instead of actual pasta, but that's for later. Oh, would you look at that? He's just launched the last pod. Alright, now it's time to build our pasta factory. To ensure we're eating pasta as soon as possible, I've come up with some simple steps to build the factory. Step 1. Locate desert by spinning around and identifying the most desert-like direction. Step 2. Walk to desert to verify location of desert. Step 3. Walk back to base and begin building train line between the main base and the pasta factory. Could I have done this with hypertubes? Probably, but I wanted to play around with the train system and it's my video, so... Step 4. Build massive platform in the air to put factory on later, courtesy of Fixit Anti-Gravity Concrete. Step 5. Begin exploiting natural resources. Okay, so the resources we need to get are as follows. Iron, copper, coal, limestone, quartz, oil, bauxite, water, and nitrogen gas. Bit of a weird ingredients list for making pasta, but we're just going to trust the process. Getting the resources wasn't too difficult since there's plenty nearby the desert. Just run power out and build the relevant machine and a conveyor or pipeline back to the factory. Most interesting part of that was when I was visited by the voices again while getting nitrogen gas. I strongly advise you to harvest this specimen. That's weird, I haven't eaten any mushrooms in a while. Now that we've got our resources, it's as simple as building the number of machines for each part that my design spreadsheet says to build. Making sure the clock speeds are set right so exactly the right amount of each item is being made because we have standards around here. With our final ingredients set up for production, it's time for the final building. The particle accelerator. Bit of a weird place to make pasta in, but maybe that's just part of the branding. Anyway, without further ado, let's get this pasta cooking. was that? That's not pasta. Hang on, what actually is nuclear pasta? Theoretical matter from the crust of neutrons. What? Why didn't they label it like that? Well, that's disappointing. I guess in the last 20 hours of gameplay I didn't manage to make any actual pasta. Unless of course you count this fucking spaghetti. Oh. 